Hey guys, Haiku here. I'm going to show you some tips and tricks about how the UI is screwing you over and could be losing you games and or just the lane. First thing that I want to show you is if you were on this side and you were harassing people or trying to kill the target, if somebody is coming from this way, do not click down here because you will stop moving. Or you could be running. and your character's not responding and you have no idea why. For some reason, even though it says disable heads up display spell click, yeah, you can't click on your spells by mistake because if you have that off, then you'd still hit your spells. Even though you have that disabled, for some reason, you can't click on the items to use them or anything, but you can't use this area to move. So if you were on this side of the map, the blue side, you're essentially kind of screwed for kiting. So try to keep your mouse in this area. So another thing that I want to show you, if you're fighting towards this enclave here, if you are clicking this way to try to move, one, you can't use your map to move. So if you have your mouse over the map, it won't let you run this way. Secondly, if you're trying to click over this way and you go to shoot and your mouse is over the map, for some reason even though turn off map interaction is off, you can still screw over yourself with the spells. So if you're playing... It doesn't work with anything else other than global. I don't know if that's a feature. Nobody I know uses it. It's done nothing besides screw people over. It doesn't do it with any other spells, just global spells. So if you're facing down this way, or if you're coming from here, down, basically never have your mouse over here or over here unless you actually want to use the minimap to cast your spells. Which is pretty accurate for the most part. It is handy if you don't know. This is another chip that you can use. It's not, it's actually honestly not too accurate like any other normal person. I'd rather click shoot. Because if you click it from this way, it's not completely accurate. Unless you've practiced a lot. All right, another thing that I want to show you is if you're ever trying to use your spells or trying to move and you stop moving, it's probably because you have shift control or alt held down. This is me with shift down and I'm trying to click. You cannot click if you have shift down. The way that you can combat in that is have it set to shift mouse button 2 if you want. Another thing that people may or may not be aware of is say you're trying to auto attack something but you're character missteps. It's because you're right clicking and you're not always going to be completely accurate. Sometimes you'll click behind them, you'll click to the side. The best way to auto attack something is to have your auto attack set so you're never out of range. You don't accidentally misclick. I don't have any attack speed so it's a little hard. But you're never going to misclick and move yourself out of position or higher than what you need to be. To do that, you go to hotkeys, player movement, and I have mine set to A. Everyone's different. You can have it set to your mouse button, you can have it set to your space bar, you can have it set to your one button, which is kind of weird. Um, you can have it set to whatever you want. Attack only click is just going to attack. It's not going to let you move or anything. So you will attack whatever you go to, but it's a little bit it's a little bit harder to do, especially if you I'm only attacking because my auto attacks on, but if you misclick, like I said that's just auto attack. If you misclick and miss it, it won't let you do it. So you want to have attack move click set because wherever you click it doesn't matter. This is the best way to get your auto attacks off as EDC. 
See how I just moved up there? It's because I used my right click. So you want to attack, move, click, click back. It takes some practice. I've been playing support a lot, so I'm not going to be perfect at it. It leaves a little bit of room for error. Sometimes you'll click forward instead of the A, or whatever button you choose to. But it'll help keep you at max range without misstepping. It'll just take some macro. So try to figure out something that's easy for you to learn. Another thing that will screw you over is if you're holding down shift, alt, or control and try to cast a spell, you won't cast it. So right now I'm holding down shift and spamming W. It's not going off. So if you have shift connected to something else, if you have fat fingers, or if you're just in the heat of the moment and you accidentally press it, you could be trying to use it and not able to do anything. Your character won't attack. So the way that I fix that is with these keybinds. I have everything set to quick cast. I don't like quick cast with indicator because it's a slower release. It'll release the spell as you release the spell button. But without the indicator, it'll use the spell as soon as you hit it, which makes it for a faster reaction. If you don't know, it's a lot easier and faster way to beat somebody. If you're facing somebody that has this and you still have quick cast with indicators, you're not going to have the same reaction time. So I set everything to an alternate set of key bindings. That way, if I need to use anything, it also works with summer spells. Because if I didn't have this, and I'm trying to hit heal, it's not going off. There's been loads of times where I've tried to flash and nothing happened. I finally figured out the reason is because of modified keys. I also have a Razer mechanical keyboard that has optic keys, so my keyboard could be a little bit more sensitive than others. It has one of the fastest response times for keyboards, so it's a little bit different than a regular mechanical keyboard. So if I just have my control gently down, it still counts as me hitting it. So if you are ever in a fight and you're like, oh, my spells didn't go off, my flash didn't go off, why didn't this happen, why didn't that happen? It's most likely because of Riot's shit UI. So have these controls set and it should help you with response time or not having to worry about getting screwed over in the middle of a heated fight. If you guys want to see more UI tips, just let me know. I have a bunch of them. I can also do a video about my spell keybinds and anything else that you might want.